Today we're doing a removal repatriation flight of Cuban nationals back to Cuba. Again, we're echoing the sentiments of the secretary and his priority of encouraging legal migration and not illegal migration. Those who violate our immigration laws and thwart the immigration system, there are repercussions for those that do that. Every individual, whether they come in through mar maritime here in Southwest Florida or along our border, the message is clear. Uh, we, we, we're not promoting illegal migration. We want to promote legal migration, legal pathways for individuals to come into the country. These Cuban nationals are being removed because they violated immigration law, whether that's through illegal border entry or illegal maritime entry. Primarily, they've all had some type of criminal record, whether that was an immigration violation or some type of criminal violation within the United States. It's multifaceted. It requires local, state, federal partners in cooperation. And I know we've messaged this before. We work closely with our DHS partners. Again, we're here to close that loop to ensure that individuals that do enter the United States are removed. And if they violated the immigration law, there's, again, there's consequences for that. Again, we just want to continue to echo the sentiments of the secretary, the agency, let people know there are, uh, we have immigration laws. We want people to come into the United States legally and not use alternate dangerous illegal migration pathways.